Cabela et al. Aim. The aim of this study is to investigate the extent to which various social factors predict occurrences of depression in an elderly Finnish population. Method. A clinical study of depression in old age was conducted in Finland in 1984 to 1985 with 1,529 participants aged 61 or older who were not clinically depressed according to the DSM-3. They were all clinically interviewed and examined again in 1989 to 1990 with 679 participants uh, uh, returning for their examination. Due to attrition, more than half the participants were lost. Social variables and the occurrences of certain life events in the period of 1984 to 1989 were measured through questionnaires. Two groups were then compared, the depressed versus the non-depressed, in 1989 to 1990. The overall the study was conducted for five years. Results. In 1989 to 1990, 8.2% of men and 9.3% of women were diagnosed with depression. A comparison was made with non-depressed men and non-depressed men and revealed that the most powerful predictors of depression were, in men, poor relationship with their spouse, negative change in relationship with spouse and neighbors, loss of a mother while under 20 years old, and a grandchild's divorce. Moving into in institutional care and alcohol problems of a close person, these were significant factors for the men. For women, the most powerful predictors of depression were loss of a father that was when under 20 years of age, low activity in religious or neighborhood events, worrying about relationships with neighbors, decline in social participation rate in the following up period, an alcohol problem of a close person, and living with one's husband but without other people. Conclusion. Social factors and changes in social ties may predict onset of depression at old age. There are certain sex differences in social factors of depression in old age, probably associated with the differences in experiencing marital stress.